How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. I want to thank everybody for uh, giving me so many video ideas in my Discord server. There's so many good ones and most of them are like different teams and strikeout or playing with another YouTuber or you know just, just a ton of good ideas. But in today's video we're going to go ahead and play Random Strikeout because I haven't done Random Strikeout in a long time. And look at this! There's a Brawl of the Week that is perfect for this. Team Strikeout. This is something that you don't normally get to play unless you're in a custom lobby. So this is perfect for me. I love Strikeout. So I'm going to go ahead and do Random Strikeout. We're going to do Team Strikeout just to get that daily bonus. And then probably after I get the daily bonus, we're just going to go back to 1v1 Strikeout. Because I'm more of a 1v1 type of guy myself. I know a lot of people like 2v2s and a lot of people think 2v2 is even more fun than 1v1s but yeah i'm just not that guy i like 1v1s better in this game anyway all right let's see who i got on my team vv next all right and i got jiro heat blast and thor so three legends that i enjoy although to be honest i enjoy <laughs> all the legends in the game so that's why i love strikeout and that's why i don't mind doing random because i literally like every legend I was trying to do a black hole with my teammate, but... Alright, the Hotori is just sig spamming, so I think we're gonna have to take her out. He got caught in between my neutral sig and Val side sig. That one had to hurt. Oh, goodbye, Kaya. She just got wrecked too. But she made it back. The best part about Jiro, though, is his Scythe Neutral Sig. I mean, that has to be my favorite move with Jiro. And I don't even know if I'm going to lose my first stock here. We're doing so good here. We may not even lose our first stock. Oh, the double? Dominating. Yep, we got that double. Oh man, let me get that three stock. Come on, Vector. There it is. GG. Woo, we got a five stock overall. I can't believe I had one of the lowest defense legends in the game and I didn't even lose one stock there. That's pretty good. All right, well, we got our bonus gold, so I think we're done with that. Let's just go back to regular strikeout. Let's see, there we go. I'm gonna go random, see what we get. Hopefully I get Magyar just because I can get a little bit more XP with him. I'm like level 23 and a half. Trying to get level 24. I played some games yesterday and some games this morning, but man, the XP, it goes up so slow. Once you get to, I would say level 20, 20 to 25 takes as long as it does to get from like one to 20, I feel like. All right, here we go. Going against Grizz. I got Petra, but I didn't even look at who my other legends were, so. Man, if I could hit him with that Kamehameha Blast, that would be awesome. Or how about the Spirit Bomb? That works too. A little side light into side air action. Am I going to get another three stock here? It's only one stock so far, but he didn't touch me a whole lot. 
And if I could get a Gimp on one of his stocks, that would really help my chances of that 3 stock. Oh, so close to hitting that side sig. There it is. And just like that, we broke his recovery with that unarmed down air, and he couldn't get back onto stage. We might get that three stock. I'm not really even trying to go for the three stocks. Three stocks. Sorry, I'm just like playing, but like if we get it, we get it. You know what I mean? Because if you're really trying to get a three stock, you, you kind of got to play like really careful and passive. And I'm, I'm not really doing that, but I'm just playing. But if we get that three stock, we get it. Oh gosh, not like this. Oh, we did. All right. GG, dude. GG. Just for kicks, like, who was my second and third legend? Oh, it doesn't even show, so I'll never know. I'll, I'll know once I watch the video. <laughs> I don't even know who the second and third legend was. All right, let's go random again. Who do I get? Ooh, Dusk. All right, Dusk is a legend that you rarely see these days. In fact, I think Dusk is the least played, least played legend in the game. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure Dusk may be the least played legend. Which is kind of weird. I mean, he has two really good weapons, especially Orb. Orb is really, really good. Although, I guess pretty much any other Orb legend is better than Dusk. Alright, so I have Dusk, Thor, and Hattori. So now I know. Alright, and I'm going against Hattori, Ragnar, and Mirage. Three, two, one, brawl. Here we go, Dusk. Let's see how we do. Dusk is hit or miss. Sometimes I do really good and sometimes not so much. It just depends. Wait for it. There it is. I knew he would jump for that weapon eventually. I mean, if if you can predict where your enemy is going to go, where your the opponent's going, you... Oh, I thought he was going to kill himself there, but I guess not. All right, here come the Ragnar Katars. Ragnar Katars are really, really good Katars in the game. You don't even have to be that good with them to... to kill because of how awesome the SIGs are. Man, he, sh he should... There it is. I was going to say, he should probably just do the neutral SIG because I was floating above him quite a bit. Alright. Another 3 stock, potentially. Imagine if I get a 3 stock every single game this video. The down sig is underrated. Oh, all right, here comes the the rage quit. No. I swear, if I die from Mirage, okay, I almost died from the computer. <laughs> but we didn't. Got another three stock in the bag. All right, so I feel bad for the second and third legends over here because we're not even getting them. Oh, all right, we got Daryl. This is an epic crossover skin for Baraza. Slightly different signature effects. Very different sounding uh, signatures, but generally they're pretty much the same exact signatures. They just look different. All right, so going against Hattori, Rayman, and Orion, and I got Daryl, Baraza, and Hattori. Hopefully we get a better match here so that we can, uh, you know. I Three stocks are fun and all, but I have more fun when we have a close match, you know? Okay. Oh, all right. Mirage, I mean, uh, Hattori being very aggressive. I like it.
Oh, ho, ho, ho. grabbed her and sent her flying with that one neutral sig. Rayman also has really good sigs, so we have to be wary of that. Axe in general is just crazy. Oh my gosh, she almost hit me with that. I, I gotta admit, that was awesome. No! He figured it out! I kept on baiting that side sig and then he... He actually... Oh. <laughs> and then he did a neutral sig, but it's all good. He threw away that lance? Why would you do that? Oh, GG. GG! We got him. We got him. I won't forget, though. He did, he did when, uh, when I did my opening taunt, he just came and punched me in the face. Like, that would help him win or something. It just, it just makes you look rude. It doesn't really help you win that little bit of damage on that cheap shot. Whatever, dude. I mean, there's no rule against it. But, um... You know, just like there's no rule against shaking the opponent's hand before a, a game or anything like that, but I just like it. Shows good sportsmanship. All right, we got Mako. This is gonna be, this is gonna be fun. Mako, I really like. So we got Mako, Linfei, and Daryl. Three of my favorite legends. Hopefully, I don't look bad playing my three favorite. Three of my favorite. I, I'm not gonna say they're my three favorite. Uh, I don't really have favorite legend in this game, but. Dude, it was like right on top of me for so long and I could not get a hit. Ooh, we got him with that little slap. Notice I'm using the Dark Heart Katars. And the Dark Heart Greatsword. Wow, I, I can't even swing the right direction. That would that would help a little bit. Oh my goodness! I kind of killed myself there. I mean, he didn't touch me, so I guess. Yeah, I pretty much killed myself. Feels bad. Dang, we got him there. He, he kept really thinking I was going to go for that weapon, but... I don't always go for the weapon. I'm, I'm pretty comfortable playing unarmed.
We hit him right with that down air. It probably killed me, but it doesn't matter. We got the win. <laughs> Alright, I'll do one more random strikeout. We're just killing it with these uh, these teams, though. I think only one game did I even lose a stock or two games. But yeah, I've lost very few stocks in this video. But, hey, you know, strikeout is pretty much my favorite game mode. Alright, here we go, here we go. Going against Tetra. I'm pretty sure if this is the same Tetra I remember. I've gone against Tetra before. Oh man, I tried to do side air, didn't work, but it worked out because he chased me, and then we got that recovery, and then we got the kill. Oh, Volkov, so mean. No, not the side six. Volkov side sig is so good on sight. Ooh, look at how cool my Hattori looks. Got you! Woohoo! We're getting with that neutral sig. Oh, almost. Oh, he jumped over that. Oh, we got him there though, boys. Woo, this is the best fight so far. Nice, nice side air. I was kind of just being aggressive on the unarmed, and I think it worked out for the most part. Uh oh, uh oh. We can't let the reverse three sock go on. Uh-oh, he actually is doing pretty good here. Oh, goodness. Goodness, golly me. There we go. We got to put an end to that. Put an end to it. Nope. Ah! <laughs> Worth. GG, dude. GG. That was a good one. Like I said, Tetra, not a bad player. No GG? Okay. Alright guys, so that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed the random strikeout. As always, please drop a like if you did. Be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. Be sure to follow me on Twitter, at LucianSword. And I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.